Mercury, a tiny planet with a radius of 1,516 miles, is just a stone's throw away from the scorching sun at only 36 million miles. At such a close distance to the sun, a year on Mercury lasts only 88 days. But don't be fooled by its close proximity to the sun. This seemingly inanimate world has a lot to offer. With surface temperatures soaring up to a blistering 800 degrees Fahrenheit, Mercury is uninhabitable. However, during the cold nights, the temperature plummets to a bone-chilling negative 290 degrees Fahrenheit, thanks to its thin atmosphere. This extreme temperature range is just the beginning of Mercury's peculiarities. Welcome to Science with Lou, the channel that brings you the most fascinating insights into the mysteries of our universe. In today's video, we're diving deep into the enigmatic world of Mercury, our solar system's smallest planet. It may seem unassuming at first, but as we explore its secrets, you'll be captivated by the wonders that lie hidden beneath its surface. Most of us are well aware that our Earth is part of a complex celestial dance, a planetary system that orbits a radiant star, our Sun. This intricate cosmic choreography consists of eight remarkable planets, each with its own unique character and allure. While Saturn's resplendent rings and numerous moons dazzle us, Mars, known as the Red Planet, has long been shrouded in captivating myths and legends. Today, we divert our cosmic compass to a planet often overshadowed by its galactic neighbors, Mercury. A few years ago, NASA unveiled a treasure trove of the first authentic images of this celestial body, revealing the exquisite intricacies and profound beauty that lie on its surface. These images open a gateway to understanding the universe's marvels. But what sets Mercury apart? What missions have space agencies undertaken to uncover its secrets? Join us as we embark on a quest to explore Mercury's mysteries one step at a time. Among the eight recognized planets within our solar system, Mercury holds the distinction of being the closest to our radiant star, the Sun. This proximity awards it the title of the first planet in our cosmic lineup. The space that separates Mercury from the Sun measures as close as 29 million miles, or 47 million kilometers, and as far as 43 million miles, or 70 million kilometers, from the Sun. The closest distance is called perihelion, while the farthest is called aphelion. This intimate proximity also propels Mercury to astonishing speeds, making it the swiftest celestial traveler in our planetary system and traveling at 170,505 kilometers or 105,947 miles per hour. This starkly contrasts Earth's average distance of approximately 149.6 million kilometers or 93 million miles from our stellar center. While our blue jewel of a planet takes a leisurely 365 days to complete its solar orbit, Mercury, with its dynamic dance, accomplishes this in a mere 88 days. Oddly enough, given this speed, Mercury still spins slowly on its axis and completes one rotation every 59 Earth days. Moreover, Mercury distinguishes itself as the tiniest planet in our cosmic family, with a diameter of only 4,880 kilometers, or roughly 3,032 miles. To put it in perspective, Jupiter stands at the opposite end of the size spectrum, towering as a colossal giant with the diameter of 142,984 kilometers. That is 29.3 times bigger across than Mercury. In terms of volume, you could fit 24,462 Mercuries inside Jupiter. Earth, by comparison, boasts a diameter of 12,742 kilometers, or 7,917 miles. Yet Mercury's distinctive traits extend beyond its size. 
during its sun-soaked days, temperatures soar to over 430 degrees Celsius or 806 degrees Fahrenheit, making it one of the hottest spots in our solar system. But when nightfall blankets its surface, Mercury transforms into a frigid expanse with temperatures plummeting to a bone-chilling negative 170 degrees Celsius or negative 274 degrees Fahrenheit. These extreme temperature fluctuations mark Mercury as the unrivaled champion in this cosmic temperature roller coaster. The name Mercury harkens back to ancient Roman mythology, where the deity Mercurius played the role of messenger to the gods, embodying the equivalent of the Greek deity Hermes. Mercury's name, a nod to this celestial messenger, underscores its significance in the realm of space research. To date, three remarkable missions have been dedicated to unraveling the mysteries of this enigmatic planet. These missions represent humanity's quest to uncover the secrets concealed within Mercury's celestial embrace. Let's delve into each mission's details. On November 3rd, 1973, a pioneering feat of exploration was initiated with the launch of the unmanned spacecraft, Mariner 10. This mission aimed to provide humanity with its first comprehensive insights into Mercury's enigmatic nature. Its journey was marked by extraordinary complexity. To reach Mercury, Mariner 10 executed a daring maneuver known as the Swing By, guiding the spacecraft into close proximity to Venus. This daring dance with Venus reduced its orbital energy, propelling it further toward its ultimate destination, Mercury. In February 1974, Mariner 10 passed by Venus before venturing closer to Mercury's orbit on March 29th of the same year. Mariner 10's historic feat made it the first spacecraft ever to explore the regions surrounding our nearest celestial neighbor. The mission, however, was not without its challenges. Operating with limited technology, Mariner 10 managed to capture approximately 45% of Mercury's planetary surface through roughly 9,000 images. Despite its pioneering efforts, the mission's results were characterized as somewhat rudimentary, leaving many questions unanswered regarding Mercury's natural mechanisms and character. Following Mariner 10's trailblazing venture, NASA embarked on a new mission to unlock Mercury's secrets. Named MESSENGER, this acronym encapsulated the mission's essence. Mercury surface, space environment, geochemistry, and ranging, a fitting tribute to its Roman namesake. The MESSENGER mission was a testament to technological advancement since Mariner 10's era. Launched on August 3rd, 2004, from Cape Canaveral in Florida, it represented NASA's determined effort to comprehend the intricacies of our solar system's smallest planet. However, studying Mercury presented unique challenges given its proximity to the Sun. The intense radiation and scorching heat demanded extraordinary resilience from the spacecraft. Unlike its predecessor, MESSENGER utilized state-of-the-art equipment and technology, enabling scientists to conduct in-depth research on Mercury. The mission's groundbreaking moments arrived in 2011 when MESSENGER entered Mercury's direct orbit, a historic achievement in space exploration. The data collected during MESSENGER's odyssey unveiled a cascade of surprises. Unusually high concentrations of calcium and magnesium were discovered on Mercury's night side, challenging our preconceived notions. Additionally, Mercury's magnetic field was not centralized, as anticipated, but nestled in its northern regions. Perhaps the most astonishing revelation came in November 2012, when MESSENGER detected frozen water at Mercury's North Pole, accompanied by the presence of organic materials within craters on the planet's surface. MESSENGER's mission came to a thrilling end when it impacted Mercury's surface on April 30th, 2015, at a breathtaking speed of more than 14,000 kilometers per hour, 
leaving a crater measuring approximately 16 meters wide. The Messenger mission has provided us with stunning imagery and invaluable insights into Mercury. One of its most remarkable features is the Debussy Crater, a massive impact crater spanning about 85 kilometers in diameter. Named after the renowned French composer Claude Debussy, this raid crater was first identified in 1969 through low-resolution radar observations by the Goldstone Observatory. Further detailed images were captured by the Arecibo Observatory from 1990 to 2005. The Debussy crater's extensive rays, stretching hundreds of kilometers, grace a significant portion of Mercury's southern hemisphere. It took center stage in the first photograph taken from Mercury orbit on March 29, 2011, by the Messenger spacecraft. These captivating images and data have revealed a world that bears a striking resemblance to our moon, enriching our understanding of this sun-scorched member of our solar family and shedding light on the formation and evolution of our solar system. Mercury's surface is predominantly marked by impact craters, azotic rock, and smooth plains. While there are geological features that could potentially form cave-like structures, the prospect of life on Mercury is exceedingly slim. The planet lacks an atmosphere, and even if there were regions with ice that could support liquid water, it would swiftly evaporate. Moreover, Mercury is devoid of water on its surface and has no carbon dioxide, hydrogen, nitrogen, or oxygen in its atmosphere, rendering it inhospitable for life as we know it. Though scientists have uncovered water ice at the planet's poles and found possible evidence for the chemical building blocks of life beneath its rocky terrain, these discoveries are intriguing, but do not necessarily imply the presence of life. Instead, they suggest that some of the essential ingredients for life as we comprehend it are present. The extreme conditions on Mercury make it highly improbable for life, especially in the form we understand, to endure there. The story of Mercury's exploration is far from over. International space agencies remain committed to unraveling the planet's mysteries. After Messenger's triumphant mission, a new era of Mercury exploration commenced. This time, two other esteemed space agencies, the European Space Agency, ESA, and the Japan Aerospace Exploration Agency, or JAXA, collaborated to bring a new spacecraft to life, named BepiColombo. BepiColombo is Europe's first mission to Mercury, the smallest and least explored terrestrial planet in our solar system. It is a joint mission between ESA and JAXA and comprises two spacecraft, the Mercury Planetary Orbiter and the Mercury Magnetospheric Orbiter. BepiColombo was launched on the 20th of October 2018 and is on a seven-year journey to Mercury. When it arrives at Mercury in late 2025, it will endure temperatures in excess of 350 degrees Celsius or 662 degrees Fahrenheit and gather data during its one-year nominal mission with a possible one-year extension. The mission will study water ice at Mercury's poles and the planet's abnormally large core. MPO will study the planet's surface and interior, while MIO will study Mercury's magnetic field and environment. The mission is expected to answer many of the remaining questions about Mercury, including why does Mercury have such a large and dense iron core? What is the origin of Mercury's magnetic field? What is the composition of Mercury's surface? How did Mercury form and evolve? The spacecraft has already made several flybys of Earth, Venus and Mercury to adjust its trajectory en route to its destination. BepiColombo's journey represents a testament to international cooperation and the relentless pursuit of knowledge, ensuring that Mercury's mysteries continue to be unveiled by the curiosity and dedication of humanity's scientific exploration. The data and images this mission will deliver are poised to be nothing short of groundbreaking. 
we invite you to share your thoughts and insights on the mesmerizing photos of Mercury captured during the Messenger mission in the comments section. Your opinions matter, and we're eager to hear your perspectives. As we draw the curtains on our cosmic expedition, we extend our sincere gratitude to you for joining us on this celestial journey through the enigmatic world of Mercury. We hope these revelations have left you as awestruck as they have left us. If you've enjoyed this cosmic odyssey, we encourage you to show your support by liking this video, and if you haven't already, subscribing to Science with Lou. Your support fuels our passion for sharing the wonders of the universe.